Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse is so good that it fixed Morbius. For those of you who didn't see that movie, at the end of Morbius, the MCU's vulture somehow gets sucked into the Morbiverse, and it makes no sense. Zero sense. It even confused the vulture. I'm not sure how I got here. Has to do with Spider-Man, I think. Well, it turns out he was right. It was, in fact, Spider-Man, just not the Spider-Man we thought it was. In Across the Spider-Verse, we learned that Kingpin's Super Collider from the first movie did more than just bring Spider-People to Earth-1610. It actually opened up a bunch of teeny holes that villains have been slipping through, sending them to alternate dimensions. The example that we see in this movie is Paper Cutout Vulture appearing in Spider-Gwen's universe, but it also explains how the MCU Vulture wound up in Morbius. This also gives them a good excuse to send the Vulture back to the MCU, the Spider Society of appears IRL and just works together to send him home. That way, Vulture can take everything that he learned from his multiversal adventure and morb all over the MCU. You know, it takes a lot to not just be a good movie, but to make other movies better in retrospect. Talk about one amazing 